Alright guys, we're back at it and today got another video with that Grim Snarl team. I probably will have maybe one or two more up and then we'll look at a new team. So let's see how this one goes. Alright guys, so as you can see, he's got some pretty big threats on the other team, but this team doesn't do overly well against the Nialgo, so I'm gonna probably lead with that. Additionally, he does have a lot of Pokemon that are weak to the Regilecki, so I think that's gonna be my lead. And let's see what he goes with. We've got Regilecki and uh, Nialgo on my side. He goes Comfy and Katana. I switch my Nialgo into Volcarona, assuming a Max Steel Spike into that slot. However, he goes for an Ally Switch and just Leaf Blades down the Regilecki when we go for an Electro Web. And then I'm going to go into Dracovish here, go for a Ficious Rend onto the Comfy and then a Heat Wave, taking out both of them there. So that was a fairly safe move. Then he goes into his Cinderace and Moltres, so I'm thinking I'm in a pretty decent spot here. I just go for a Ficious Rend and a Heat Wave, do a ton of damage and kill his Dynamax Pokemon. Uh, then his Moltres goes for a Fire Wrath and we go for our last Ficious Rend and take that out. So I guess that was sort of a match for the Scarf Dracovish there doing some pretty beastly damage. I was a bit surprised to see that the katana wasn't sashed. Didn't really make too much sense to me, uh, at least unless the comfy was, but it just doesn't make sense. It definitely needs a sash, uh, particularly with the rest of the composition of the team. I'm surprised as well that he didn't bring the thunderous. I think that would have done quite well against my team. Alright guys, so that's for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. If you did enjoy today's video, check out some of my others. I'm sure you'll like them just as much. Anyways, 